The pandemic means most of us have lost control of key elements of our lives, but one way to ease that, reach out to others. And that's what these volunteers are doing. They are working on behalf of the Port Washington Saltville Rotary Club and Meals on Wheels. They made a commitment to deliver meals every other Sunday. Local restaurants are also helping out. I talked to Rotary Board member Joe Dean about this gesture of kindness. Jody joins me from the Port Washington Softville Rotary Club, and we appreciate you being with us this morning, Joe. Carol, so great to see you again, even through this technology. Yeah, the circumstances aren't ideal, but you know what you're doing is perfect for people who really need help. Can you explain what you're doing? Well, Carol, uh, our motto at Rotary is service above self, and we just consider it such a blessing to be able to help a few people. Actually, it's more than a few now. We've delivered uh, over one, well, 139 meals. We'll soon be delivering over 200 meals uh, to people who have hit, hit a rough patch during this coronavirus crisis and, uh, you know, maybe living paycheck to paycheck and out of work and so on. So we've just been very happy to get out and uh, rounded up a bunch of volunteers and raised a little bit of money and working with local restaurants here in the Port Washington, Sockville area. We're delivering meals uh, every other Sunday as long as, as long as we can keep it up and as long as we keep raising money, we'll do that. You know, I think this is wonderful because, Joe, a lot of people really can't get out. We have a lot of senior citizens and we have some people that have special needs and other people just have health conditions that they really don't need to be anywhere exposed to anything. You're really making their lives better. Well, it's, uh, it's really joyful for us to bring people just a little bit of hope. You know, a meal on a Sunday. We work, we partner with Meals on Wheels here in Ozaki County. And um, like all of these things, you get so much more, you know, the people are so appreciative and we do it all with the right social distancing and we had special rotary masks made up with our logo on them and uh, we've just got a fantastic group of volunteers and, and the community as it always has here you know just came together and uh, we hope to be able to do this for a long time. What is some of the feedback that you've been getting from some of the people who have been delivered meals Joe? Well, um, people come to their door and, you know, we stay six to ten feet away, but they're just, they're so appreciative and, you know, they say God bless you and thank you so much. And it's just amazing what that neighbor to neighbor kind of reaching out, lending a helping hand, one meal, you know, but it's just amazing how much uh, joy that can bring into someone's life. Um, and again, we just consider it such a blessing to be, play a small role in that at our Rotary Club. You know, and I know you have volunteers that actually help you from the Rotary Club. Families are really getting involved and taking their cars and helping to deliver. Yeah, we had a long line of cars outside of Tello's restaurant this Sunday, who is our partner this Sunday. And um, what's really encouraging is we see families, you know, gathered together in their minivans and they all have their masks on and all of that. Um, but I think it's a teachable moment for kids as well. And uh, we get calls back that same day that people say, you know, this is one of the most meaningful things they've done since they've been locked in and quarantined. And I think it just really helps people feel better that they're out doing something for the community. And I understand that your members are donating your dues to help buy meals. Yeah, so we got a little grant from the district, Rotary District, and then we all decided, hey, we're meeting on Zoom instead of in a restaurant. Why don't we just donate all of our all of the money we would normally spend on meals and on our dues? and. Uh, we'll contribute that to Meals on Wheels and see if we can keep this thing going for a long time. And then the local restaurants are partnering with us and trying to do this at the most reasonable cost they can, and they've been very generous in their support. Well, Joe Dean, it's a wonderful project, and thank you for delivering smiles and hope to so many people in Ozaki County. Our pleasure. Thank you, Carol. And if you would like to help, you can find information on the Port Washington Saltville Rotary Club's Facebook page.